Hello viewers, um, this is a promotion for the 12 maps I've now completed. Uh, plan to probably make a few more if I can get time to do more. We've got the weapons um, three quarters through the development and I hope promised, um, Woody from Metal Game Studios promises uh, February or March for the weapons to be ready. We just got to get money to get um, the menu made up, settings menu and the advertising money. Uh, this is me Alice Springs Army Camp. Um, it's got a lot of vehicles, wrecked vehicles and stuff. You can get in those, get climb all the ladders on those guard towers and stuff. They're the sandbags. And that's the mess tent. Um, that's the Chinese APC. This is the Australian APC. Um, blowing up tank. Blowing up truck. Blowing up jeep. That's a Chinese tank. And that's where they're invading from on this base. They're coming in, overrunning the base. You can climb that tower and snipe off the tower. There's three platforms on it. Um, yeah, I'll get another map. Uh, this is me River Bend Cave map. It's got a nice waterfall there. Little village little village huts um, the objective is to get to the base by getting breaking through the barrier on the bend and there's another objective to hold them back from these caves so that they can take a shortcut through there's a rock in the middle of the cave there as well so if you're in there um, plenty of foliage. Um, and it just goes out to the other base down here. That's what the Asian base this end. And it just goes into there. I'll be putting a player boundary limit there. That's that map. Uh, this map is me comical drive-in map. That's the Chinese Jeep. That's the restaurant thing. And that's the backdrop of Darwin. Uh, it's a toll booth. It'll mainly be a fun game. That's a video I got streaming which will play live in game with sound. Uh, sort of fight. One base here. Another base up at that shop. Yeah, that's Darwin map. Uh, Drive-in map. Hello viewers, this is just a promotion to me. 11 maps I've finished. Um, our weapons are 90... 90% ready and Woody from Metal Game Studio pr uh, promises uh, promises um, between February and March and we just got to get money to uh, get a settings menu made up and advertising money um, all the buildings in this map this suburban map of Darwin you can get inside of. It's a Chinese tank. There's lots of wrecks around. All the buildings you can you can shoot out of and that. Um, this is the Osrin Tavern destroyed pub. pub. And you can see the United Nations is parked out the front with the Australian Bushmaster having a drink in the pub. Uh, there's some pre destroyed vehicles that were there previous. Um, 
You can get inside all the fences and backyards and things. That's the church. You can get inside the steeple of that and shoot out. Yeah. That's that one. Uh, this is me Forest Hills map. Just um, tropical forest in New Guinea. And the steep rocky hills in New Guinea. Get across that bridge there and... It's got bird sound effects in some of those maps as well. So you approach certain areas, birds will start squawking. One base will be here. And, um... It'll be a bit of a tactical shooter, this one. No vehicles in it or anything, but... Lots of sneaky places. It's got, um... That's the water. It's got a bit of a stream there. And a waterfall over here. Where the other base will be. Uh, plenty of foliage. Even got daisies. <coughs> Pardon me. That's that map. And they've got the gum trees. These maps have got actual gum trees, if you hadn't noticed already. That's that map. Uh, this map is about Murphy's Quarry. Uh, some destroyed tanks and whatnot. Chinese tank. The tank's got sound effects, and so has the APCs. Uh, you can get up these ladders here. There's ladders there that you can get up so you can get under that roof there to stop being shot at by the people on the side of the quarry wall. Because you can run up the run up here. That'll be one base in that cabin. And they can run up here. And up here to do some dirty sniping. Uh, capture the flag will have another base down here at this office and do the same up the side of the walls uh, also there's a ladder oh yes um, there's also a ladder here behind this thing on the other side side of the map as well climb up there and get around here and in there and you can also get on the top of this thing from jumping off here onto that wheel onto the conveyor belt and onto that conveyor belt and you can also get in here and use this for cover to shoot the ones on the walls if you're in the middle of the map Uh, yeah, that's that map. This is me outback map with all the red rock. Uh, that's a Chinese base there where they're camped at the hut. And, um, you can see the textures on the rocks look pretty good. The best way to attack the enemy base the Australian base is that big tent down the bottom. I don't know if you can see it or not, but you can either run through the chance it through the middle or go up on the side of those cliffs. To get to the other base. It's just a supply tent. There's a little barricade. couple of wrecked vehicles um, this is the other side of the the map where they can run that'll be a probably have a bit of concentrated fighting around there and a bit of sniping going on that's that map
This is another map with a cave in it. It's sort of subtropic terrain, rocky terrain. That's the Chinese rocket launcher, where they're invading the Australian US camp. That'll be the Chinese base. And there's plenty of nice rocks and stuff. There's a chopper wreck up here. Um, they can get through this cave to get to the other side without being shot at by the people on the side of these hills. And you can also, on this side there's a ladder. You can get up here on the middle outcrop to shoot those on the side or whoever you want to shoot virtually. Um, a few destroyed vehicles. Chinese APC. Australian APC. That's the Australian base. A couple of Bushmasters. Um, that's the barracks tent. And there's a truck with its load tipped over. And there's plenty of rocks and uh, cover. And you can see the sunlight effects are pretty, lighting effects are pretty good. That's that map. Uh, this is a rework of the beach map I originally started a while back. I finally finished it. Um, that's the Korean Chinese base. That's where they're both both rushing the beach to get into this um, inlet in here so they can get on the mainland. Um, there's plenty of rocks everywhere to get to advance on as usual. Um, this is the Australian American base. Another mess tent with their VB cans and stuff. Uh, that's the water. You can see it's got waves. That'll do that map. Uh, this is the last map village. It's about a twin village sort of thing where the village has got the river running through the middle of it. There's chairs, tables, and um, beds in it, in all the huts. Got campfires where they cook their dinner and that. Um, there's a ledge up here that, for the one side of the village, to shoot the other side of the village. I'm not sure where I should stick the bases yet, either either end of the river or either end of the village on those rocky outcrops. Some opinions would be good. This is a waterfall I got up the other end with some fancy steam effects. And this is the other ledge the other side of the village and it's got the sun on its assistance you just run up there all right thanks for watching